wolf tracks right here. And look at here. He bedded down right there in that spot. Yep. People Wait. laugh at my measuring stick, but a dollar bill is six inches long. Take a look at the size of those tracks. Over, over on the Washington coast, my grandparents had a cabin over there, and we used to use a dollar bill to measure the backs of um, crabs. To be legal, they had to be six inches. And if, um, if a dollar bill fit, fit across your shell, then we knew we were good. Yeah, that's a good-sized wolf. It looks like he's by himself, though. Don't they want to go up and look at it? Yeah, well, I would think. I'm not sure they knew about these either. I need to bring him up here. Yeah, pretty neat. I don't remember this. I thought they, this was all sticking up. It was erected still, and these logs were hanging over. Yeah, I think it was. I think it's collapsed some since we were here. Well, that, that tree didn't help any. Uh-uh. Yeah, this outhouse, it was out on a log up over this big hole. It fell in. This road. <laughs> look at the look at the drop off here. Snow doesn't seem that deep until you find a spot where it's melted away. It's in places anyway. It's probably three feet. You get down here and you see bare ground though. All uneven. This is where I had my traps last winter. A couple of cows I brought up. Doesn't look like anything fresh here. Once the snow melts enough, I'll come up and haul this out. But No sign of anything fresh. Here's some tracks up here though. What are these? Those are bird. They gotta be a turkey. Huh. I haven't seen any turkeys back here. That's what it looks like. even making a dent. Now look at these ruts.
So coming around the corner and driving up the road and look what we found. Right there, square in the middle of the road. Right there? Yeah. Yeah, that's the spring. It was fenced all the way around it. Yeah, somebody's. <laughs> I bet they got a point on the other end. Look at the hammer marks on top of here. That would be a mine claim post. There's a flat up here above. I've been thinking for years we ought to set up some tents and have a hunting camp here, but hunting around here has been so poor, it's hardly worth it. There's a little pond right here. You can kind of see the ice. I don't know if you'd want to drink that water, though. <laughs> okay, so don't laugh at us too hard. Bodine says we have to do this. <laughs> You're gonna get hurt, you know that. No, I know it. Just don't sit on the stob. Can you climb on? It's gonna break. No, it's not. <laughs> 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 Look at it. <laughs> Just go, oh, it's gonna break. <laughs> Okay, let me down over here. He's gonna break. He's gonna get. He's gonna get killed. <laughs> okay, okay, that's enough. <laughs> let me down. <laughs> uh, you better get off. Get well, we're already half past our lifespan. We gotta do something fun. That's true. <laughs> Well, a few elk tracks. Sass, what are you doing? Well, low on gas. This spot here it used to be a mine. It used to set right down off the hill right here. There isn't much left. They, for whatever reason, they tore the building out. And, uh, I don't know, it kind of seems to me that the what was piled up here, I think, burned in the forest fire. I should walk down here and look. I don't know what kind of a mine it was <clears throat> or when it was. Yeah, there's nothing left. Plywood, a few odds and ends of boards. But uh, years ago we came up here and they were actually doing some core sampling. Must not have found enough to bother with it because they tore that building out. It used to sit right here. Matter of fact, huh, look at that. I never noticed that before. There's a big round steel tub looking thing right there. 
Dang it, now I gotta go down there and check that out. Huh. Not really sure what that is. <clears throat> Funny, I've been here, past here a million times. I've never noticed that tub before. I don't remember the last time that I actually saw that building. It's been quite a few years ago. Like I said, we come by here one day and there was a bunch of guys here and they had a whole bunch of, a whole bunch of trays laid out. And they were going through rock samples and whatnot, and I don't know what it is they're looking for, but something to do, most likely with gold. This whole area is kind of known for gold, but most of it, I think, has been found. The stuff that's left is really small. Um, Leesburg was so tiny that they were using uh, cyanide to leach it out of the rock. That there's a little bit of metal somethings here. Not much left. This big giant rock I bumped with my truck the other day. <laughs> it's a big one. We were wanting to roll it off the mountain. I'm not sure we can budge that thing. He's got a little winch. We're going to try to winch it over to the edge and see if we can get it to roll. This might not work. He's going to try to get onto it downhill. That's a big rock. So why are we doing this? I have no idea. But because it's fun. <laughs> Hold on, hold on. Oh, I'll back up. Well, so far so good. Okay, turn it sharp that way. Okay, um, a little more, real sharp. There? Yeah, I think so. Maybe crank it a little harder against the hill. A little more. I think you're good. I don't know, Jethro, don't go back no further. <laughs> <laughs> You're right on the edge. Is that going? It's close. I think we might be able to roll her. Here we go, here we go. Oh, cramp! Cramp! Oh. 
There it goes. Well, that didn't go very far, did it? Well, that was disappointing. I thought I'd go a lot further than that. Figured we'd hit the creek bottom. <laughs> My eyeballs hurt. <laughs> Your eyeballs hurt. <laughs> well, at least it's out of the road. Yeah, there's kind of a hard tell on the camera. It comes down a steep slope, then there's a flat, then it goes down again. I think we just made it over the, it's right there. <laughs> well, that was fun. I haven't rolled rocks in many years. So. <laughs> oh, boy. Things you do for fun, huh? That little machine's amazing. I wish I could afford one. Really about like a snow cat. With those tracks on it, I mean, there's not very many places you can't go. While well, he's turning around, what the heck, huh? Shoot, that one went better than the big one. That's what I was hoping the big one would do. Ah, anyway, it's been a fun day. Kind of hard on these tracks when there's no snow. We've been Trying to go slow and easy on the dirt, but it's still hard on them. <laughs> oh, anyhow, thanks for watching, folks. See ya.